Hey YouTube, this is Alex, back with another video. This is all stuff that I got from the last week or so, uh, over the weekend mostly, and the beginning of this week, and some of the stuff I got from today. So here's the stuff I got from today. I went back and I picked up Justice League number four. I didn't get that last week for some reason. Suicide Squad, I thought the second cover was pretty awesome, and I will actually go back and get the number one cover of number two because I like that cover as well and I'm not sure why I didn't pick it up today. Action Comics 963. We're finally gonna start to find out uh, who this Clark Kent is and why there's a Clark Kent in the same world that there was a Superman that died, the New 52 Superman, and uh, the pre-New 52 Superman. So that's gonna be a good read. I also picked up Flash this was the only cover that Slackers had. I picked that one up. So either way, I like this cover, so it's good. This is stuff I got in Chicago on Monday. So this is Uncanny Inhumans, number zero, signed by Charles Soule, the writer. And what was really cool was these were at, uh, at a half-price books in a box that was marked autographs or signatures and autographs and it was you know five dollars so I thought that was a great deal here is 108 flash 108 from volume 2 and it's signed by Mark Waite Mark Wade and I was looking for this book anyways and to find a signed copy for five bucks was even better here's another Inhumans this is the Marvel Now I believe from 2013. It's also signed, as you can see up here, by Charles Soule. Found these at an uh, antique shop up there. This is the first time I've ever owned uh, Man of Steel 17. It was $3. And then I picked up the anniversary copy of Action Comics 544 with the uh, more beefed up Lex Luthor and the newer Brainiac give Superman a little more challenge back in the 80s or whenever this book came out but definitely a cool book to own so back to today's haul I finally found a copy of Uncanny Inhumans number 11 and this if you know is the first mosaic if I'm wrong I'm sorry but I believe that's first mosaic I'm, I was looking for the the uh, original cover, not this variant edition, but uh, I wasn't going to pass this up because everything else was second prints on the other stuff. This is back to my Chicago haul. Sorry I'm jumping all over the place, but this is uh, Superman Adventures number five, the first live wire. That's my second copy of that. On to some Batman stuff that I got in Chicago. So that's uh, Jason Todd as Robin, introducing Jason, you know, the, the new boy wonder. Picked up some Hush books, uh, seven fifty for that one for six oh eight. The beginning of Hush, six thirteen was also seven dollars. I have about five copies of this book, six twelve. But every time I see it, I get it because I just love that cover. And then I found this book, six thirty eight for three twenty five. Three twenty five. So I'm gonna get these out of the way. found The Amazing Spider-Man number four, The Original Sin, that was the first silk for $12. This is the big score, I think, of that, of that um, shop. Was the variant edition, and I believe it's the Grand Off edition, 569 of The Amazing Spider-Man Venom uh, variant <clears throat> for $6.85. And if I'm not mistaken, I think this is like a $60 book. <clears throat> Found two second editions, so the second uh, printing of the first appearance of Carnage. I have two or three copies of the first printing, so this is 361, the second print. And the, re the way you'll know that it's the second print is this gray background here. It's white on the first, for those of you who didn't know that. For a dollar, 
I got Suicide Squad number 23, and that is the first appearance of Oracle. I have three copies of Just Society of America number one, and that is the first Jesse Quick. So there's that. Good look at that cover. This is my second copy of The Flash Volume 2 138, the first Black Flash. 139. Another copy of 139. I, I'm probably up to four or five copies of that as well. Two copies of 140, part two of that storyline. And then two copies of 141. So the hype is that the Black Flash is going to be in the new Flash series. But I've also heard Savitar is going to be in that um, series as well, in the new uh, season, excuse me, season three of The Flash. So who knows, but I like, they just came out also with the trade paperback of that. So that is, uh, I just like the book. It's an awesome story. Um, last but not least is a book that I've been searching for. And when I saw it, I was kind of disappointed with the price, but then I looked it up. It is a book that you all will recognize. So I put it in the top loader as well. It's Batman 635, the first appearance of Jason Todd as the Red Hood. And as you can see, the sticker is on the, the, the bag. But it was $22. And this thing is absolutely flawless. ETA Nick would appreciate the tight corners, the perfect lines, um, but this is, it's just a, a, you know, near mint copy of this book. And for $22, I couldn't pass it up. I was going back between, be, back and forth between this and he actually had a, an amazing Spider-Man 122, which I don't have that book yet. I'm also looking for a 121 and I would take that book in low, low grade. But I decided to spend my money on this yesterday and I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. And I'm pretty happy with the price too, because I know this book can go, people are asking 70, 80 bucks for this book, um, you know, raw. So anyways, I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you so much for all the subs. 15 subs in one week. I officially started this channel last Wednesday. And so this is my one week anniversary. Thank you so much. Um, I, I've been trying to watch a lot of videos and comment on a lot of guys stuff just to be active in the community. I think one of the most flattering things is is to get those likes and to get people um, having conversations and commenting on the books that you get. And so Semper Fi Comic Guy, Comic Estite, Don the Comic Junkie, all, all you guys and, and all the rest of you guys who have subbed to my channel, thank you so much. I've been watching you guys for a long time and I'm a huge fan of you all. Um, so thanks so much. It's very flattering that you guys subscribe to my channel and that uh, I just hope to, you know, be an active member of this community. So thanks a lot, guys, and um, I will come out with another video later. See you guys. Be well.